Brazil is going through an interesting moment, very high housing demand and very low supply in urbanized plots of land. Real estate prices index in Brazil, state capitals has risen 210% since 2008. Now supply in these markets can only focus in the high income segment. Middle and low income markets account for more than 90% of the housing deficit, some 800,000 units per year. Unorganized own building has been the natural answer for these consumers. Integral urban developments that count with low cost plots of land can address this market segment with profit. Investors can now be able to have consistent return on their investments for the next 20 years, the period of Brazil's demographic bonus. The lack of urban infrastructure is the main cause of the housing deficit. The government complex licensing rules and urban management deters advance in urbanization as well. The neighborhood association is the key in supplying public services where it is lacking. Urban areas cannot be created simply by house constructions, but by offering housing along with utilities, employment, education, health, leisure and mobility. The, the Neighborhood Association uh, offers missing public services and makes these new urban complex viable. In order for a new urban complex to be successful, it has to accommodate people's needs, which are diverse. Brazil's current housing program focus is to increase the offer of two-bedroom units to the low-income segment. Although positive, the government program needs to be improved. With the, with the help of GSD, it has become clear that we have to offer a variety of house technologies integrated with business, private and public services in order to create a successful urban complex. The proposed integration was a collective of collective spaces such as parks, clubs, retail and mobility grid that emphasizes bike and public transportation.